Okay, so question three. What is the electron configuration for titanium 2 plus? So for electron configuration questions, uh, we need to follow the following steps. One is to divide your periodic table into the different orbitals. So either S, E, D, and F. So I can show what that looks like. Periodic table. So it's actually pretty simple to divide it. Uh, you can see the two left columns and helium are light blue and they correspond to the S block. Uh, the green kind of rectangle here is the P block. And the middle transition metals is the D block. And finally, the last two, uh, the bottom two rows are uh, the lactonides and actinides, and it is the F block. So after we divide the periodic table into these orbitals, then starting from hydrogen, You kind of move from left to right down the periodic table. Move left to right. And then you want to write your row number, then the block letter. Uh, once you get to the D orbital, it becomes the row number minus one. And once you get to the F block, you write the row number minus two. Okay, so this will make more sense if we just do our Example first. So for the question, it's asking for titanium 2 plus, I believe. Yep. So notice that the titanium has a positive 2 charge, so this means it lost 2 electrons. So to help us write down its electron configuration, uh, we first need to write down the ground state electron configuration for titanium. So this is when it's just neutral, no electrons have been removed. And so let's try to find it on the periodic table. Uh, you can see it's right here, atomic number 22. So starting from hydrogen, if we move left to right, when we write the row number, it's row one, the block letter, is S, and then to show uh, the number of electrons up to helium, it is 1s2. Then we can do the same thing for row 2, block S, and then up to the beryllium, which is here, it'll be 2s2. And then moving over to the P block, it is 2p6, so now we're at neon. And then over to the next row, it's 3s2, and then 3p6. And then moving down, it would be 4s2, and then 3d2. But once we get to the transition metals, 
um, it's good practice to uh, write the block letter in order of um, increasing energy. So uh, I'm going to write the D block first. So 3D up to titanium is 2. And then the 4S orbital, which is lower in energy, or higher in energy, sorry, is 4S2. So I kind of just switched the two around. So you'll notice that when it comes to the transition metals, uh, the D block and the S block uh, tend to switch places. Okay, so this is the electron configuration for ground state titanium. If we wanted to write this in the shorthand configuration, all you need to do is find uh, the noble gas that comes before titanium. So in this case, it's argon. So I'm going to write argon in square brackets. And then we just kind of continue on writing the rest of the electron configuration. So it's argon, 3d2, 4s2. Okay, so now for the question, we want to look at titanium when it has two electrons removed. So basically, when two electrons are removed, we're going to take the two electrons from the s orbital. So it becomes argon 3d2. So this is because partially filled, or I'll just say the filled d orbitals are more stable. Okay, so let's see what the junior tutor said. Okay, so to answer this, we need to first determine the electron configuration of the elemental titanium. By inspecting the periodic table, titanium belongs to period 4, group 4, and has an atomic number equal to 22. The atomic number tells us that the neutral form of titanium uh, must account for a total of 22 electrons. Therefore, the configuration, I think they mean to say titanium, in elemental form would be 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6, 3d2, 4s2. Now we have the titanium ion. Uh, the 2 plus here means that titanium loses, I think they mean two electrons from its outermost shell. In this case, the two electrons lost would come from the fourth energy shell, uh, two from the 4s orbital. This means that the electron configuration would be 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6, 3d2. Yep, so this solution is correct. And then I'll just put in brackets to fix the typos. Titanium 2 plus means that titanium loses two electrons. Okay, so on to question number...